Say here in Japan, Ohayo gozaimasu. <laughs> so um, yeah, <clears throat> I'm in Japan again, and 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 well, this is the first day, kind of. It's actually not the first day. I've been here for a few days already to uh, yeah get used to the jet jet lag again, and um, yeah, I think I did now. So um, yeah, uh, the, the the past days, I would like to explain you a bit about that. Um, but that will come later because I would like to walk around again in Tokyo and uh, uh, because it's mm, it may be kind of, it might be a bit um, uh, 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 boring when I'm walking around so I would like to explain some stuff I have done uh, with my friends here uh, in the past days and yeah showing that stuff like in between you know what I mean never mind <laughs> So, um, today is Getsu Yobi, which is Monday. <laughs> um, so, yeah, uh, I have actually no clue where I'm going today. Um, I only have like three full days I can use uh, this time. Well, which is like one day more than last year, so it's totally fine for me. Um, and I'm going to spend some other days uh, like like uh, next week together with my friends. So um, uh, yeah, I think you're going to see a lot of stuff here. And I probably cut a few parts again for the vlog because we just we experienced so many things in the last days. I have to cut it because uh, there's so much stuff going on. So um, yeah. Um, I would like to show you my room again <laughs> because this is this is not the same room as last year. It's actually mirrored, <laughs> so um, it pretty much looks like the last time. So it's not really big. You only have a little hallway here and my bed, which is there, and a little TV, some stuff, uh, and yeah, the 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 toilet and um, bathroom. So. Um, but I really like those small rooms because uh, you you pretty much have everything you need and that's totally fine for me and I can open the window which is very really good <laughs> so um, what time is it oh yeah Nanji <laughs> desu uh, yeah I, I actually learned a bit Japanese um, for the past two and a half years now uh, together with uh, two friends and um, I hope I can use it a bit because the last days were actually pretty funny. Uh, it, I mean, I don't really speak Japanese yet, but uh, I know the topic uh, when when they are talking about stuff. So, which is really nice. I mean, it's so funny to finally understand this. <laughs> so yeah, um, it's five minutes past eight now. So, uh, like the last time, I'm starting in the morning. Ending at some point, I don't know when. <laughs> um, I have my little backpack with me, and yeah, I think we should start. Maybe I, I, I have the TV on again. I don't know what it is, probably some kids' TV right now, but uh, maybe I'm going to show some stuff later on. <laughs> I'm not sure yet. Um, yeah, but I should leave now. Okay, so let's go! <laughs> So it's time to go. Ikki masho. Suck it out, it's out, and do that. And we are leaving. It's just the best city in the world. Yum, 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 yum. Yeah. Yeah. 
funny. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I wanted to tell you the stuff which was going on uh, the past days. Um, well, at first, after landing, my good friend Scala, his boyfriend uh, Paul, and Utaino, they picked me up from the airport. So um, this was it was really nice because uh, yeah, actually they they spent all the days with me together, which was great. Um, because it's always good to have someone, somebody around you who knows uh, where to go and how to do things and stuff. So um, I would like to thank you uh, for that. Yeah, uh, on the first day we actually did something really, really nice. <laughs> because, um, you know, I love bungee jumping and um, well, in Germany and other countries around Europe, it's not a problem at all. But uh, nobody has done it so far in Japan. So we thought, okay, let's give it a try and do some bungee jumping here. And, you know, think big. We yeah, just took the, 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 the highest bungee platform here in Japan, which is 100 meter. And yeah, we drove up there and we all did it together. Um, it was a wonderful experience and yeah, you're going to see some stuff of it right now. We're never gonna hit the bottom Don't be scared of falling down Stacking up the dreams you've got them Soon you'll be the one wearing the crown They tell me that I've reached the bottom Now all that I can see is sky Look up to my dreams, they wonder all that I can do is try Show me the way when my wings are broken Show me the way when I fall in I'll still be the light. 
So I really hope you enjoyed that. It was a lot of fun. I mean, we were screaming as hell and yeah, it was just so much fun. Tanoshi! Totemo Tanoshi! The first day was really great, so, uh, so as you can see. Uh, we visited an onsen and uh, very nice restaurants and yeah, we had a lot of fun for the whole day. And I'm really thankful for this, this experience. And I mean, we were the first um, first to just bungee jumping in Japan, so it's like a big honor to be part of that. Yeah, uh, the second day. <laughs> the second day was also very, very nice. We uh, drove by car to the north uh, west part and we wanted to do some kart racing. Um, I've never done kart racing before because I was always afraid of getting very dirty and stuff and but um, this this was kind of okay because um, it was very dry so there was not really much dirt on the street and um, the cart itself was also very clean so it wasn't a problem at all and yeah we had a lot of fun and <laughs> were driving very fast and well it was my first time so um, <laughs> I didn't really yeah, made it to the first place. I was actually, I think the third or last place, I don't know. But um, that doesn't matter, it was a lot of fun and we, we and really enjoyed it. And um, yeah, uh, the problem was uh, the material of my GoPro uh, is not the best because uh, the positioning of the camera was too low and my face is like out of camera all the time. But uh, still, we got some nice material and I want to show it to you right now. All right. Since the day we found you, you have been
So as you can see, it was a really, really lot of fun and yeah, we enjoyed that. <laughs> um, yeah, so, so uh, we also visited um, a very big shrine, an Okami shrine, which is a wolf shrine. And that was really cool because, I mean, I'm a wolf, so um, we, we, we've been there just in time before they are closing. And um, yeah, it was really, really nice. I, I, I finally, yeah, I finally been to a wolf shrine and um, yeah. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, there's no um, uh, 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 video footage of that. But I wanted to say that because it's it's really great. So <laughs> I shouldn't talk that much. I mean, you know, I did this uh, little uh, voting last video uh, in the last video, and you said it's okay if I talk a lot. So uh, well, I do, <laughs> and I'm really sorry for sorry for all the people who are doing the subtitles because I'm talking that much. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Anyway, anyway, let's walk further and see some more stuff. <laughs> lost already <laughs> uh, I love it to be lost anyway uh, it's such a sunny day today but it's really really cold I'm actually freezing ah. Ah. so let's see I think I finally found the way again. I walk in a totally wrong direction again, as always. But at those uh, subway stations, there are actually some some little uh, maps right at the entrance, so I could figure out where to go because I don't want to use my phone again. Uh, besides that. There's one thing which is really annoying me right now and that is that my GoPro batteries are kind of suffering something, I don't know what. Uh, whenever I start the GoPro, just for a tiny amount of time, like a few seconds or so, uh, the battery goes like 
minus 10%, minus 20%, minus 10% and it's gone. Um, I hope it's going to work. If not, uh, I might record with a, uh, with a phone later on. But um, yeah, it should work somehow. Okay, so I walked like a huge loop. Um, but I think in that direction it should be Akihabara again. So yeah, I will just go there. Oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Finally found that river again from last year, the Kanda River. I think that's that's the one. That means that Akihabara is somewhere over there. So <sighs> I'm back on track, but I have no idea. It's like I don't know, 10 o'clock or maybe 11 already. So I'm walking since two or three hours now. I'm gonna check that soon. But um, yeah, sun is shining. It's good. So I'm happy. <laughs> so um, yeah, let's go further. Ikimasha. <laughs> Ikimasha, by the way, means uh, let's go. <laughs> Okay, this is actually Akihabara station. Yay! It's the right one. <laughs> Ta -da! Made it. At least a bit. <laughs> okay, let's see if I can... Yeah. I don't know. Find another way to somewhere. <laughs> I mean, I have, I have no destination, so... Yeah. Let's see how I'm going to end. no idea why but I'm always lost <sighs> so I had to get my smartphone again and check the way um, yeah I need to well uh, actually I, I have a destination right now so um, uh, uh, I changed my mind I wanted to go back to Odaiba uh, and see the rainbow bridge uh, not at night but on the daylight so um, I thought I'm going like the other way around as the last time and see the rainbow bridge first and then walking through Odaiba like uh, at night daylight which is a bit more I don't know I can see more then <laughs> um, so yeah my phone says one and a half hour for yeah 7.6 kilometers but that should be all right it's not that far
Look at that. It's a huge egg or something. I don't know, but it looks nice. I'm getting very close. The phone says 1.5 kilometers left, but that's okay. <laughs> ah, great! I made it, and it's not that late. It's half past one. <laughs> but I know that this street up there is the street I was driving on with Uta Ino yesterday, and. It's the one which is on top of the Rainbow Bridge. Uh, now that it's actually daylight in daylight, I, I can really see how big this bridge is. It's wow. It's amazing. You're gonna see that. I'm around the building in a few seconds and yeah. yeah, yeah. And a vending machine. <laughs> so, oh wow. Okay, okay, wait for it, wait for it. <laughs> Okay, this is huge. Wow. And there are two levels. This is amazing. Wow. I haven't seen it in daylight. Huh. Yeah, so let's cross the bridge, I guess. <laughs> So let's go on the sunny side, which is the other one. <laughs> Ding. Dang, dang, dang. I don't care about the the pain of walking or the pain of this this backpack or something. I don't care. As long as I'm here. This feels like home. Yeah it does. <laughs> you somebody that'll talk like you somebody that'll float 
Odaiba Beach, yay! And it's still daylight, yeah, but look at that. I'm so happy to be here again. Ah. This is amazing. Ah. I know it's probably some kind of weird if you see this and to see me that I'm happy, so happy here to, to just be at some, some location like this but you need to imagine um, this is always a dream coming true when I watched Digimon as a child and I mean even now um, it's, it's, it's very special to me to be at a, at a location like this where all those things happened out of season 1 and 2 and uh, yeah actually all the seasons and it's so special to be here it's so special to to have this opportunity and to I don't know to, to be able to do this I'm actually kind of emotional to it <sighs> I love this. Can you hear the So they have this little Statue of Liberty here. Uh, last time I haven't had the time to uh, really look at it, but this time I have. So huh, let's see how it looks like. It's not that small actually. <laughs> touched where I'm going on and this is a great feeling <laughs> uh, wow <sighs> okay 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 <sighs> I have to use the time I have to use the time okay 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 I'm gonna go up there and then to the left because there's some other building from Digimon I haven't seen last time <sighs> the day should be like 40 hours long so you have enough time to sleep, enough time to eat, enough time to pursue Eat, sleep, pursue, repeat <laughs> That's the building over there
I'm here at the telecom center, which is right there. And I just had a look on my phone to check how far I, I have I've been walking today. And well, I think I, bro I broke my record. Um, I'm at 31 kilometers. Oh, this is yeah, this is a lot. I'm glad I made it so far, but I'm probably going to take the uh, the, the train back because I mean it's the sun is setting and I'm kind of dead. <laughs> But yeah, um, I want to get a bit closer to the telecom center because it uh, really looks amazing and it's huge and I want to show it on video. So um, yeah. <sighs> I just met one German guy who uh, he was really nice. Uh, he took some photos and uh, yeah, we talked a bit. And I also have seen um, two Japanese guys who helped me out to uh, to get where I would like to get. <laughs> I mean, yeah, actually today is a holiday, so we cannot get up there, but um, we can still take some photos. So, uh, well, videos, whatever it is. Wow, this is big. I want to stay in the middle. <laughs> this is very huge. Still the Suica card, as I've mentioned in the last video, and well, you just take a look where you want to go. Uh, in this case, I want to go to Shinbashi, and well, from here it takes 380 yen. So, okay, so let's go to Shinbashi. So this was a guy from, from London actually, but uh, he's German, so uh, we talked a lot at the, at the train and he was very nice, he was really a great person. If you see this, <laughs> um, a lot of greetings to London and maybe next year to Japan because you are moving there, so I wish you good luck and uh, all the best. So <laughs> and uh, yeah. Okay, I'm in Shibashi now and I have to go to, uh, I have to take the Ginza line to uh, 
Inachi or something, or maybe Ueno. So yeah, let's go there. Headed back to Ueno Station. So, time to get out here. And yeah. Then, back to the hotel. <laughs> there we go. I know that my right feet car is probably getting a blister again, but oh well. to summarize the whole day it was a lot of fun I I've been walking for the whole day um, I've met several very interesting and very nice people and I'm really happy about that especially the German guy he's he, he was so great <laughs> so I'm very much looking forward to get some food now and to get back to the hotel and rest a bit and stuff and yeah of course cleaning and brushing my parachute so so, let's get inside and get some rest. Okay, so let's see. The time is half past five. So that means I've started at eight, so nine, eleven. Uh -huh. I can't count. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. So nine and a half hours. Whew. That was a nice trip. I think we should check uh, how far it actually was. Yeah, we're gonna see that. <coughs> oh, the window is still open. Uh, oh well. I can't. I can't take this because I mean, I'm, 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 I'm like here, you know. So I cannot take my my Google. And it says. Can it actually focus? Uh, I think so. Um, 32 kilometers. Five hours and 35 minutes active time. Uh, yeah, because I made some breaks, I guess. And 13 kilometers and 43 minutes with a train deck. Yeah, so I think this was a very nice trip. So, yeah. Um, that's the end of the first part. I guess I see you in the second part. Bye bye.